The 47-year-old lawyer has criticized Germany's 1.1 billion euros dollar deal as compensation for the 1904-08 number of Iraq genocide as a disgrace and shameful, urging descendants of victims to unite, saying in fighting major rail, the prospects of a genuine demand for reparations. I think the German government lacks of political will to deal seriously with the, the many German colonial and war crimes, and above all to draw the consequences resulting from historical responsibility. And you are right, development aid is not reparation. Of course, it isn't. Uh, the 1.1 billion euros the German government wants to provide over a period of 30 years um, are disgrace. Absolutely, I agree. And I am aware of the fact that uh, that agreement, the joint declaration, has also led to fierce debates in Namibia concerning enrollment of the affected communities and the parliament um, and of parliament and um, as well as regarding the results of the negotiations negotiations in general and whatever criticism possibly justified may be expressed it should, should not be forgotten that the german government bears the main responsibility she says germany is also fighting criticism for refusing to renegotiate the joint declaration by framing the outcry in Namibia as an internal conflict. Based on my experience in the field of foreign policy, I believe that further, and this is very important, uh, further fragmentations of Namibian society would further weaken its negotiation position vis-à-vis -vis Germany. It will weaken this. It will weaken and therefore, in solidarity with your purpose, I would like to recommend, if I am allowed to recommend, that Namibia acts with a strategic, and you talk about strategy, strategic unity and speaks with a united voice in the negotiations with Germany. I think this is very important because they try to really misuse and, and uh, they try to divide. Machiavelli said, divide and conquer. Divide e impera. And this is how it is working at the moment. This is exactly the way it works. Dach Dillen promised to sensitize lawmakers in Germany on the 1904-08 Nama of Herr genocide in pursuit of a resolution in the Bundestag to sanction renegotiations. I will, when, I, when I'm back in Germany, I will consider all this uh, meetings and my uh, talks and um, I will have an exchange with my colleagues in the parliament within my own parliamentary group, the Lika, but also with the other ones and from the other parliamentary groups because uh, one thing is right. I am a very passionate parliamentarian. I really believe in the in the strength of the parliament. And as parliamentarians, we should take it in our own hand and don't let it be just on the, in the hand of the governments. The lawyer turned politician will also visit memorial shrines in both Okahanja and Waterberg to pay respects to the heroes and heroines of the ferocious colonial German regime.